This is the Lamborghini Veneno. Uh, it's a car we are just building in three units. They are all sold, two, two to America, one to Saudi Arabia. Uh, these cars are made also to celebrate our 50th anniversary. This is one of the main reasons. And, uh, you know, if you do a, such a small number of cars, you have a higher freedom in terms of design. You can test and utilize new materials and technology. You have a positive effect also on the rest of the product lineup. And then you make people dream. And for some of them also, the dream is going to become true. And uh, it has a V12 engine, 750 horsepower. The weight is 1,450 kilos. So the power to weight ratio is below two, 1.93 uh, per horsepower. Zero to 100 in just 2.8 seconds. And we limited the top speed to 355. It's going to be more or less on the same level as last year. This is the first uh, thing I'm going to see because we have markets which are up, but we have other markets which are going down. To make a real forecast, it's too early still. I'm still cautious. Um, I learned a lot between 08 and 2010. The crisis hit us very hard, not only us, but the entire luxury and super sports car business. And it's not yet on the level uh, of 2007. Okay. Like the up is the US, yeah. which is our biggest market. Yeah. So this is welcome, very positive. Chinese market in terms of the super sports car segment is going down. Uh, Europe is uh, lights and shadows still. Uh, Southeast Asia is stable. We will see in the next one. But for sure, they want to reduce the extremes in the, in the showing the high net individuals and uh, the very poor people in the country. Uh, there will always be, uh, let's say, directions uh, which are changing from one to the other. Um, what we see is that the, the total market is going down. In terms of the safety or the approach of our customers, we are very cautious because we do uh, driving academies. We are doing uh, all what is necessary to give the people the skills if they want to you. We cannot uh, push them into, but we try to give them the skills to drive those uh, cars in the best possible way and to be safe. For what Lamborghini concerns, I can clearly state no. The made in Italy for, and these cars are really on, in a good shape. Last year we presented an, uh, a concept car at the Beijing Motor Show. I said that we need a decision in this year and I hope that we will get it. And if we get it, it will be big and good for Lamborghini. But it's clear that if we uh, are stepping into uh, the SUV segment, then it's only possible if we share the platform within the group. So it will be on the same platform as the Bentley SUV. But for a small manufacturer like ours, uh, the only way really to flourish and to get bigger, even the example of the SUV is clear. It's out of the technology of the group and out of the platform of the group. Otherwise, it would be impossible.